Any of you want your tea leaves read? Oh, and I had a cup of Sanka. I can read that, too. <laughs> Since when are you a psychic? Since when do you need to know my business? Well, I'm sorry, Libby. I just didn't know you were a fortune teller. Are you calling me a liar? Uh, hey. Could you do my cup? Yeah, sure. Oh. Oh, never mind. That's Raisin Bagel. <laughs> I am seeing two people very much in love. I am also seeing a very happy marriage. Ah, to who? Uh, I'm getting an F. As in pharmacist? Well, uh, pharmacist begins with a P, honey. Yes, but his name is Fred, and that begins with an F, doesn't it? Oh, Val, remember when we were at the pharmacy the other day getting tweezers? Fred kept staring at you, and we thought that it was because you had that Q-tip stuck in yeah. your ear. But maybe it was love. I am also getting a semi-attached condo villa in phase four, <gasps> and lots of babies. Oh, you're gonna have sex. <laughs> what about me? What about me? My psychic powers tell me you already had sex. <laughs> No, do me, do me. I don't do diet soda. Come on, what am I, a quack? Sit down, give me a palm. Okay. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? I see you very happy with your three new kids. No, 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 wait. Make that two. <laughs> Things look really good for you. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What's with the uh-oh? I see your husband with a sexy blonde with great legs. I'm gonna go blonde? It ain't you. Well, if it ain't me, who is it? What's my husband doing with a leggy blonde? With piercing blue eyes. <laughs> um, I'm seeing Beverly Hills. I'm, I'm seeing them in bed together, their arms wrapped around each other. <laughs> well, don't you see anything good on this hand? Your skin snaps back like a rubber band. <laughs> Darling, don't be ridiculous. What is that no good yen to gypsy psychic no? My future. She said Max was gonna have an affair with a lecky blonde. Oh, my God. You think it's me? <laughs> Ma. I'm sorry, but since I lost the weight, your husband has been giving me the eye. <sighs> He's just in shock at how big your head looks now. <laughs> Ma, she saw them kissing in Beverly Hills. We can't move to California. Although, on the upside, when you get a divorce in California, mm. you get half of everything. <laughs> Particularly if he leaves you for someone who's younger. Ma, she didn't say younger. What, he's gonna leave you for someone older? <laughs> Big head. <laughs> Darling, you're putting your faith in a woman who sweeps up hair at the chatterbox. I don't know about that place anymore. The last time I had my hair done there, when I got home, I pulled out the two Reader's Digest I stuffed in my blouse. It was from 1994. I was almost too embarrassed to put them on my cocktail table. That story disturbs me on so many levels. <laughs> All I'm saying is you are overreacting to that shysta Libby and her voodoo. Mm, maybe you're right. I mean, she said that Val was gonna get married, and there's no way that... Hi, Fran. Val? The psychic was right, Fran. You know Fred the pharmacist. Yeah, hi, Fred. We're dating. Hi, Fran Sheffield. How's your well? Did it postulate? <laughs> it was a small red mark. No, it was like an egg clear was sitting in there. <laughs> you two start dating? Today, but I loved her from the first time I saw her, standing catty cornered at a Metamucil display. You know, the orange-flavored laxatives you buy, Fran Sheffield? <laughs> Ma! Ma, my life is over. The psychic was right about Val, and she's right about me. Oh, darling, you're not thinking straight. You're too wound up. <laughs> What psychic wouldn't predict that dumb and dumber would eventually find each other? <laughs>